Meanwhile, operations are back to normal at the airport this morning as thousands get ready to take off for Thanksgiving. Chrissy Diaz is hanging out at the airport for us this morning, keeping an eye on some things you should and shouldn't do as you get ready to head out for the holiday. Christy, what are some suggestions out there to help make sure that airport experience is smooth? There are three main things, Aisha, that we'll go over this morning. But right now, this is their busy holiday season, and over the next week, more than 2.2 million people will come through Hartsfield Jackson, and they expect the levels or the numbers rather to be or hit pre pandemic travel numbers. So here are a couple tips to make your trip run as smoothly as possible. The number one, you see it right here. This is still the number one rule. Do wear a mask when you come to the airport. It is still a federal mandate, whether you're here in the airport or you are on the plane. Now, if you don't, you could be stopped. You could be removed from your flight or you could face some pretty big fines and that will definitely slow down your trip. Now, here's the next one. If you're a frequent traveler, you already know this. Get to the airport early and around the holidays. This is especially important. They're suggesting that you arrive two to four hours hours ahead of time. The busiest days this week are expected to be Wednesday, the day before Thanksgiving, and then the Sunday after. And then finally, there is a new location to catch your Uber or Lyft when you get to the airport or you need to pick up. They've moved the pickup location to the lower level. So if you need to get there, you go to the North Terminal Baggage Claim, then go down the escalator. There will be orange signs, though, to help direct you down there. Airport workers say they'll do everything they can to get you in and out as efficiently as possible, but they're also asking that you do your part to make it go smoothly as well. Guys.